What's up, guys? And uh, today, right, we're we'll checking out the uh, nuclear war mod. Mod. So basically, it's just like a Cold War simulator. Basically, it's it's called the nuclear war mod, but it may as well be called the Cold War mod the, or the Cold War extension, because yeah, it is basically just the nuclear nuclear war is pretty much just the Cold War. When nuclear war is just like a fancy term for when a war is for when a war uses nukes nukes and but the only war that actually like like the only war technically no the only ones that were used were the ones in world war 2 so technically actually not think about it world war 2 is the only nuclear war so so this i actually might not be, be correct but but right anyways this is a a mod that's basically extending the Cold War mod now. Now this mod is absolutely awesome. Like I've played through this mod and it's really awesome. Um, they even have more campaign missions, plus a proxy war too. They're working on this, and we've got special operations. I really enjoyed this one. This one was my favorite. The the Antarctican war one, that one, and there was the yeah, North American, there was like a North American uh, campaign, too, that was really enjoyable, too. So, uh, these... So, uh, those add a bunch of new journals, too. Those, they, I think they were at, at, like, 30 new journals, I think, I think maybe, like, 50 or 40 journals. Okay, so, um, let's just go and check out, check out some of the uh, conquests. The conquests are the most important part of this. You know why? Because the conquests, they have so many of them. Look at the amount of conquests, and there's more co coming soon. There's like four that are coming soon. Oh, let me count them out. Okay, that's five. Uh, that's five. That's five. 7, that's 15, uh, 20, 20, and then another 5, and then, we, and then, so it's 25 conquests in total, and then minus the 4 that are still being worked work on, but you have 21 conquests, that is insane, like, the amount of effort they put into this mod is absolutely insane, see, this could be, like, a DLC, see, to be honest, this could be, like, like, I could see this potentially becoming, like, a DLC for World Conquer. I could pretend, put, definitely potentially see, see uh, Easy Tech actually asking the creators of this mod to turn this mod into a DLC, a Cold War DLC for, for the game. Yeah, and like, a, a, an add-on extension, but I feel like, no, but I think DLC is only for, for, for like, PC or something, and it, uh, the World Conquer for isn't on, on PC, but it would be nice to have, like, an, an add-on pack. Heck, maybe like like a, a, an extra uh because I believe the game is free, free. But I I definitely would be I definitely would pay pay a a, a, a couple of dollars to get something like this because this well this is was like this is like the DLC movie kind of stuff you know there are tons of conquests and these conquests are also like uh, okay so let's play as uh nineteen sixty two we'll play as um. The U.S. I guess. Alright, so, uh, Chris. Okay, yeah, yeah. And so, so this is the one, on right here. So okay, and then the, yeah, they also add, add, add new uh, Jones. Of course, yeah, these are the Cold War Jones. So what they only just add War Two Jones. Of course, this is this is a nuclear war mod, so it makes sense that they will add a Cold War Jones too. So, um, uh, um, alright, so this conquest, this conquest is really, these conquests are also really fun, they give you a, these are the, yeah, the drones that you get, and then, yeah, you have to get, you have to invade, uh, now, but the problem is that, wait, when you're playing as any country, if you play as any country, the difficulty is still pretty much the same, like, each, both sides are but pretty equal, I would say, both sides are pretty equal. So, 
So, um, so I know, okay, you also have, have some troops in uh, Germany right here. So I definitely may consider doing a, a video on this in the future. If you want to see a video on on a, the nuclear war mode, I'll be more than happy to do a video on, on it. It's I think it's in, instantly become one of my all-time favorite mods. Mods definitely has a lot of potential for videos. Definitely does lag my phone though. Yeah, because there's just way too much here. So it does kind of lag the phone. But I think it doesn't make it like completely unplayable. I think it's still playable. It's just that you're not going to get very, you're probably not going to get like very high quality or, uh, or frame rate. But hopefully, hopefully you can still enjoy it too. And then I guess we can maybe play some of these like, um, Soviet missions. We could do inv Invasion of Denmark. So I believe this is just a reskin, right? This is literally just a reskin of yeah, yeah the the operational reskin, but, but except they replace uh uh the Soviet Union. No, no, no. They replace Germany with the Soviet Union, and then they also put a Norway up here. So we've got some British uh, backup too. Now the funny thing with Cold War mods is the that. That the Cold War isn't really a war. Again, again, it's kind of like a collection of wars, wars because there's like proxy wars and stuff. So you could you could consider that as the Cold War. So the Cold War is basically just like a war that isn't a war. It's just a collection of wars. Was that that uh, have it. actually the ones that we should. So the ones that uh, we shouldn't, um, hold on, uh, I need to, okay, I need some time to think about what I want to say. So, okay, okay, I, ha I forgot what, about what I wanted to say. I would, let, okay, let's just move on with, uh, this, this, let's just move on, okay. I can't remember what I said, I said something about... Uh, oh yeah, yeah, right. Uh, the the proxy war. So I think the ones that we should be talking about more are the pr proxy wars. The thing is that the Cold War is just a collection of wars, and nobody actually died in the Cold War. Well, the Cold War isn't a war again; it's a collection of smaller proxy wars. But, but the ones that actually had casualties, the ones that really had an impact, were the proxy wars. I definitely do think we should be talking about the uh, proxy wars more. Hmm. Hey, so I'm definitely gonna do some ep some episodes on this. If if you want, want me to do some episodes on this, or maybe some other mods, you can leave them in the comments. But but re but regardless, I'm I'm definitely gonna do some episodes on this. On this, this I don't really get the, that many comments on my videos. Uh, anyways, but okay. So, thing is, I guess I need to come back because I can't stop recording if it's if, uh if it's behind the screen. And yeah. They've already made a full set of missions. I think this is a full set. I, I, I don't know. So technically, the final mission here is the invasion of, uh, like, this, like, I think that's called a Kamchatka or something. Or maybe Kamchatka is just, like, this island. I, I'm not sure. Well, it's, they're only being some side view. They're not in Moscow yet, so it, they could, it could still be in, uh, um, development. Uh, okay, Refugio. Let's try Operation Refugio, I guess. Operation Refugio. Oh, okay. This is this is gonna be an issue. This is definitely gonna be uh, an interesting one. And I don't. And they also. I don't know why, but they also put yeah, these uh, these like uh, these 1940 ge ge no, no, the, the 1980 ge Germans, the uh, terrorist Germans inside again. Okay, if I do get mods on my no 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 if I do get a mod today on my videos, I'm hoping they would demonetize me. Yeah, please please do not uh, demonetize me YouTube. It would really help if I could do this as at least a port time port time. I I'm hoping that in the future I could do this as port time because it's it's really fun doing YouTube. YouTube it's like it's like doing your favorite hobby. 
and, but you get paid to do it. So let's say your your favorite hobby is drawing. Then you can get paid. You can literally get paid to do that your that favorite thing. Thing which is in which is which is insane. It's it's fun. You getting you getting a you getting money from uh doing from doing a hobby. Just by doing your hobby, you you can get money by doing that. And yeah, it's really a very really, uh, cool way to earn money. Definitely do want this to be a part time in the future. Um, let me take. Mm-mm. Oh my god! Okay. Wait, how how is he already dead? Oh my god! Okay, this is gonna be a difficult one. I already know it's gonna be. Let's try Sunrise Phase 2. Let's see what this has to offer. Uh, oh, okay, so we do have the, the beam. We do have the Ion Cannon. I think that's what you call it. I think you call it the Ion Cannon, right? I think that's the name for it. So, uh, so we need to... I guess we'll do crits off. Oh, wow, that's some damage. That's some serious damage. And, oh, wow. There were so many... And, what is Russian name? Oh my god. Common. Komso. Molska. On. Amor. Is, is that. How pronounce it? Um. Petro Pavlosk. Kamchatsky. Sky. Uh, 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 like Russian names are just in, weird. Weird and insane. See, no, no offense there. I'm not. I'm no offense. I, I'm just saying that. They're kind of weird to people who don't speak Russian. Russian, they're really long. They're just really long. I don't mean any offense to Russian pe- people. I'm just saying that it, it's kind of ho- it's kind of hard to pronounce when you, you don't speak Russian. And same thing with, uh, of course, uh, other languages. So, oh, yeah, this is gonna be yeah. All these missions are gonna be some really long videos. I can already say that these are gonna be some long videos. And we got uh, the Greek Civil War, which is the only mission that they have in the proxy wars. Okay, Greek Civil War. Um. Hmm. Oh. Okay. So it's it's it doesn't seem like that whole horde of a mission, but but we do uh um. It seems like we do uh have some. We do have uh, some, some uh, you, yeah, we've got Yugoslavia and Albania who are going to provide support for, for, the co- for the communists, which is going to be, uh, yeah, this is going to be a difficult one. This, it isn't as difficult, it's definitely not going to be as difficult, but it's still, it's still, it's, it's still going to be quite the challenge. Be, uh, actually, all of these are going to be quite the challenge now, now that I think about it. So, I think that that's pretty much it, right? We, we, we've covered the conquest, we've covered the scenarios, we've co- covered the new journals. I think I think that's pretty good, good for uh, a review. I cover all the key points. But anyways, thank you very much for, for watching this uh, video. And I will see you guys uh, next time.